Hey there, I'm your host today. Welcome to the Think, Learn, and Gain Knowledge channel. Today we're looking at percents and how to understand what they mean. In daily life, this shows up everywhere, like figuring out the cost of discounted groceries, maybe a cool shirt on sale, and more. I want you to understand that percent just means out of 100. That's it. It's like a pie sliced into 100 segments. Let's say I have 75 of those segments shaded yellow. That means 75 out of 100 are shaded yellow, and as a percent, that means 75% of the pie is shaded yellow. Let's walk through an example to understand how this works. You bought a hoodie for $40 after a 20% discount. So, what was the original price P? Here's the trick. Start by figuring out how much you actually paid in percent. 100% minus 20% is 80%, so 80% equals $40. Now let's solve this using the first method. Step 1. Understand what the $40 represents. It's 80% of the original price. Step 2. Convert 80% to decimal form. 80 divided by 100 equals 0 0.80. Step 3. Set up the equation. 0 0.80 times P equals 40. Here, P is the original price. Step 4. Solve for P. Divide 40 by 0 0.80. That gives you 50. So the original price was $50. For method 2, let's break down this percent problem like a pie chart. You paid $40 for the hoodie, but it was after a 20% discount. So if the pie had 10 segments to represent 100%, that means 8 segments of the cost is what we pay for representing 80% of the original price. So we need to divide $40 by 8 segments to know the price of one segment. That's $5 per segment. So if each segment is $5, how much is it for all 10 segments? That would be 5 times 10 to give $50 for the total original price before the discount. There we are. Isn't that easy as pie? In this example. A student got 18 out of 20 on a quiz. What percent is that? Just divide 18 by 20. That equals 0 0.9. Now multiply by 100 to convert to percent. 0 0.9 times 100 is 90. So the student's score in percent form is 90%. Here is another example. You saved 15% of your $600 paycheck. How much did you save? Just multiply 15% by 600. That's 0 0.15 multiplied by 600. The answer is $90. So you saved $90 from your paycheck. Just remember, percent word problems usually ask you to find one of three things. The part, the whole, or the percent. Think of them like a puzzle with three pieces. The whole is the total amount, like 100% of something. The part is just one piece of that total. And the percent? It tells you how much out of 100 that piece represents. Thank you for joining us today to learn about percent word problems. This is the Think, Learn, and Gain Knowledge channel. See you next time.